It's the little car that could, and 30 years later, it still does. Mazda's MX-5 Miata has been earning industry praise since its debut. 1989, in Road and Track magazine, I saw the ad for the Miata, and I knew instantly that was my car. The Miata filled a niche when British MGs and Triumphs ceased production. Today, the Roadster that's been called the world's most beloved sports car and best-selling two-seater convertible doesn't disappoint. Well, I just talked to a gentleman had uh, 200,000 miles on his Miata, uh, so they last a long time. There's nothing like it on, on a nice sunny day with the top down. It makes you feel better. It's cheaper than uh, Prozac. Have you ever ridden in a Mia uh, Mazda no, Miata? but I have a Corolla. Al Miola is past president of the Mass Miata Club and MCs the annual Miata Day here at Lars Anderson Auto Museum. This is the largest gathering of Miatas in the Northeast. Last year we had 195 cars. We have people coming from Virginia, uh, Maine, New York. They come to commune, show off, and compete. People are positively passionate about their cars. Well, this is the 2015 anniversary edition. They only made so many of them, like a thousand. And this is number 429. But I've wanted one for like 20 years, and finally the daughter's out of college and stuff, so now it's time to just have some fun. 30 years ago, Chronicle's Mary Richardson road tested the then new Miata following a consult with Junior D'Amato, the auto doctor. It's the uh, thrill of the uh, 60s with the open air feeling with the technology of the 90s and a car that uh, doesn't leak or break down. So you'll have a lot of fun with it. I don't know who was more fun, her or the car. And to date, the car's still a fun car. Fun and all grown up, says D'Amato today new Miata, you can pay up to $35,000 for a loaded one with the 30th anniversary, even higher. And now they're about 180 or so horsepower, two liter, six speed manual, which back in the 90s, you didn't have that. So at 60 miles an hour, 65, you were pretty much out of breath with the engine because the engine was revving. Today at 65, it's like you're doing 35. The Miata is a really true little sports car. According to the Sports Car Club of America, the Miata is the most road-raced car in the U.S., possibly the world. Behind the wheel here, Rebecca Harvey. They call it a momentum car. In other words, we're making a slow car go fast, which is really the most fun type of racing, in my opinion. This is a 1995 Miata, which is the first generation. So I have a 2003 Miata that I drive to work year-round, including in the winter time. I have snow tires on it. I have the race car and the street car. 30 years and four generations, from pop-up headlights to hardtop convertibles, in a word, heaven. Durable. Amazing.